The Fatui from Snezhnaya are known to make waves wherever they go in Tevat, and Tartaglia is a driving force within them. Of the eleven Harbingers, ten concern themselves with clandestine operations. Tartaglia is the sole exception. Rather than lure his enemies into a trap, he prefers to face them head-on in one-on-one -on -one combat. The wind is picking up. There is conflict in the air. His reputation precedes him. Child is known far and wide as a fearsome warrior. Well-versed in a variety of fighting forms, he can switch stances at will and has two distinct modes of attack at his disposal. When Tartaglia is in your party, all characters' normal attacks gain one level, dealing increased damage as a result. Tartaglia is weakest with a bow, so he chooses to use one precisely to overcome this weakness. His normal attack can combo up to six consecutive shots. Charging the attack executes a more precise shot that deals increased damage. While aiming, hydro energy accumulates on the arrowhead. A fully charged arrow will deal hydro damage to enemies on impact, and also apply the Riptide status to them. When an enemy is affected by Riptide, further hits from Tartaglia's fully charged arrows deal multiple bouts of area of effect hydro damage. Also, when Tartaglia defeats an enemy affected by Riptide, it causes a Hydro Burst, which applies the Riptide status to nearby enemies. Unlocking the talent Never Ending extends the duration of Riptide. Faced with a strong foe, Tartaglia will reveal his true might. When he casts his elemental skill, he summons weaponry fashioned from pure Hydro, dealing Hydro damage to surrounding enemies in the process, and also switches to his melee stance. In this stance, his normal attack now combos up to six consecutive Hydro Slashes. Charging the attack consumes stamina and releases a two-slash flurry, dealing Hydro damage. In melee stance, when Tartaglia strikes an enemy affected by Riptide, he deals area of effect hydro damage. Tartaglia exits melee stance when his elemental skill is cast again, or after a certain time has elapsed. He then returns to his ranged stance, and his elemental skill enters cooldown. The longer Tartaglia spends in melee stance, the longer the cooldown time. After unlocking the talent Sword of Torrents, when in melee stance, if Tartaglia deals a critical hit, the Riptide status is applied to the enemy. Depending on Tartaglia's stance, his elemental burst will unleash one of two different attacks. Riptide! In ranged stance, Tartaglia swiftly fires a Hydro-imbued magic arrow ahead of him which deals area of effect hydro damage, and also applies the Riptide status to enemies. Afterwards, Tartaglia regains some of his spent energy. Shouldn't let your guard down! In melee stance, Tartaglia performs a slashing attack with a wide area of effect, dealing substantial hydro damage to all surrounding enemies. And if the elemental burst hits an enemy affected by Riptide, the Riptide effect will be consumed in a hydro explosion which deals area of effect hydro damage. Tartaglia is a formidable warrior who lives for the heat of battle. He chooses his moments to attack and retreat, and is tactical when selecting his mode of attack. This is what makes him so powerful. Faced with a single opponent, start by firing at them from a distance to apply the Riptide status. Then, enter melee stance and go in for the kill. Use fast and frequent attacks to trigger Riptide effects and deal immense damage. Against groups of enemies, build up energy in advance and unleash an elemental burst in ranged stance to apply the Riptide status to the group. Then enter melee stance and attack the enemies affected by Riptide, hacking away at their health while also restoring Tartaglia's energy. Wait for an opportune moment to unleash another elemental burst and take them all out in one go, bringing the battle to a clear-cut conclusion. 
Few know where Tartaglia acquired his fighting skills before becoming a harbinger. Nor do many know where his lust for combat originates. There is a dangerous secret to the martial legacy he inherits, but it is one that even he himself does not fully understand. Since becoming a Fatui harbinger, fighting for the Tsaritsa is his new motivation as a warrior. Child is the Tsaritsa's weapon of war, and he stands for the might of Snezhnaya. An icy storm is starting to blow towards the other nations. Brace yourselves. Tevat is about to get cold. <laughs>